Rams playoff team, Tampa Bay playoff team, Buffalo playoff team, Houston playoff team, San Francisco playoff team, Dallas playoff team, and Green Bay playoff team twice. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of your 17 games are going to be against playoff teams from a year ago. That is a much more difficult schedule than they faced in 2023. I'm not going to say. Oh, you're right. I don't, I don't want to. Um, I, I would say over because. Yeah. Um, I, I do think they're also going to be one of the top two or three best teams in the NFC, but they're going to be challenged every week. This team last year was so fortunate to not really deal with any major injuries to anybody on the offensive side of the ball. And this team wins with offense. This team wins because of offense on the offensive line. Yes, they missed uh Frank Ragnow a couple of games I think Amon Ra missed one or two yeah. uh, Jameer Gibbs I don't know if he missed any David Montgomery missed three or four fine but it was nothing significant it was nothing that they couldn't get through I don't know if you can have that type of health for two years in a row I I don't know everything kind of lined up for them last year injury wise and defensively you took it look look at some of their big guns you know, Aiden Hutchinson stayed healthy uh, yeah. all year long. Um, yeah, obviously the CJ Gardner Johnson was a little bit of a blow to them, but then they had Tracy Walker step up for them. They had this uh, diamond in the rough with with uh, Brian Branch who came up. So it didn't feel like the injury to CJ really hurt him. So when you look at these win totals and you look at the schedule, you do have to consider the fact that for the most part, this team was very fortunate with injuries last year. I All think, right, so what, go ahead, Brian. I think also what you have to look at is I think we got to stop looking at things as if the Lions aren't what they are. I think sometimes we get caught up looking at how good a schedule is because of how good the teams are, but your team in the Detroit Lions are no longer mints me. They're no longer – they're number four in the whole NFL as they finish. They're number two in the NFC as they finish. So when I look at the schedule, yeah, it's going to be tough, Ryan. It's going to be a lot tough for Mavs, but they're better than Arizona – they're better than Jacksonville. Seattle doesn't have a quarterback. Tennessee is in shambles. And Indianapolis Colts, we have no idea where Anthony Richardson is going to be. I look at those five games right there. Lions are much better than all five of those teams. 